Hello guys and welcome to another Premiere Pro tutorial. Today we are going to be talking about motion tracking. I'm going to be showing you how to do manual and auto motion tracking of objects in Premiere Pro. Okay, so I have this video down here and it's just some ladies walking past the road and I have this call out graphics that I want to place over my video and track it. So what I'm going to do is to place this call out graphics over my video track 3 over here. But if I move, you will notice that it's essentially a still title. There is no animation or anything on these graphics. So the first thing I'm going to do is to move my playhead to the beginning of these graphics over here. And while selecting these graphics, I'm going to move over to my first control panel over here. And under position, I'm going to toggle on animation by selecting this stopwatch over here. So at this position, what I'm going to do is to move my X value to the reference point of my object and my essential graphics over here. So in this case, I want to place the graphics to be pointing at the head of this lady over here. So I'm going to fit it into 150. I want it to be exactly at her head here. So I'm going to scroll it down. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit shift plus the right arrow to move five frames forward. And I'm going to be tracking these graphics with this position of her head. So I'm going to hit shift and the right arrow. And I'm going to adjust these graphics. So I'm going to continue to repeat this process until I've completely tracked the motion. So I'm going to fast forward this right now. And as I do this in my first control panel, you will notice that keyframes are being added over here. So I'm going to fast forward this right now. So as I hit on shift plus forward arrow, I'm going to be adjusting the X and the Y value of position over here to align with my reference point of my object, which is this lady over here. Alright guys, so I'm not going to track the entire 15 seconds clip. So if I fit this now and hit play from the beginning, you can see what we have created over here. But let's say you want to blur the face of your subject over here. All you need to do is to come over to your project panel over here and select new item, adjustment layer and hit OK. Now you drag this adjustment layer onto your track layer 2 over here. Select your adjustment layer and go to my first panel here and search for the mosaic effect. Now select mosaic under stylize and drag it onto my adjustment layer over here. And the next thing I want to do is to move over to the first frame of this adjustment layer. And under my first control panel here, I'm going to set my horizontal blocks to 100, my vertical blocks to 100. And I'm going to create this create ellipse mask to create a mask around her face. So I'm just going to resize this to fit the portion that I'm trying to cover, which is her face over here. So I'm going to fit this so you can see it properly. Alright guys, so I'm going to fit this back. Now the next thing I'm going to do is to toggle on animation by selecting this stopwatch icon over here right next to mask part and I'm going to hit this play icon and it will automatically track her face and now if I hit play now you can see that it has really tracked her face but areas where it's not properly tracked you can always come inside and fit it properly to your liking and that's it guys on how to auto and manually track objects in Premiere Pro. I hope you found this tutorial very useful. If you did, give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to drop your feedbacks in the comment section. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. See you in my next video tomorrow.